What's up, everybody? It's the best bot kiss move back with another quick video. And when I say quick, this is going to be quick, man. Um, played Redfall PC Xbox. It's not a review. Just wanted to give my initial discussions. I experienced two crucial issues uh, early that they have to they have to address. Uh, Redfall is an online only game. I know they're working on the patch to make the take away the online only feature. Uh, one of the first experience uh, that I had in regard it being regarding it being an online only game is that uh, I first booted the game up on Xbox Series X, uh, played about what, 15 minutes, boom, got disconnected for no reason. Now, mind you, I was not playing co-op, wasn't playing with anybody else. It was just me going through solo and got disconnected. You get disconnected, you get kicked from the game to the menu again. So if this is like for a, pub, a developer that doesn't do online games like online only really should not have been a target for this game because now my thing is i'm going to feel they're a bit incompetent in that area and it, it you know i don't trust that the game can get me through a session long enough to keep me online where i feel comfortable like hey i can play this without being kicked from the game um the other thing is uh obviously on console it's 30 fps so it's not optimal the game speed is actually pretty decent though the game does for the type of game it is the speed is good enough where um the 60 the 30 fps uh, performance is actually passable um but i still obviously prefer to play at 60 or better so i did boot it up on pc where i got to play at um i want to say high settings uh 1440p uh 80 plus fps and i'm proud and i'm almost certain because my I, I was not using my gpu utilization was not high at all i probably can actually do a full um 4k on this game um and and, and still get 60 fps or better i just didn't you know bother you know aiming that high um but when i was playing on uh pc uh the issue i experienced and now i don't know if this is a game issue maybe it could be a pc issue i have a 37 uh 3070 ti i have an i 790 whatever 100 whatever i have uh 32 gigs of ram um i have you know three ssds in this bad boy i have um and my power supply is 750 watts so i'm not i'm not sure uh what was causing it but you know 10 minutes into the game um it would power off my pc it was shut off like i i'm not sure why but i was like all right maybe this is a fluke and sure enough, every time I play, all I need is 10 minutes of game time. Boom, PC was shut off. And to the point where it took me an hour to get through the first mission playing on PC. I was enjoying the performance that I got, the visuals I was able to play at, the, uh, the quality that I was able to play at. But that is not optimal. That's not ideal. If the, the experience, my PC powering off at that time, I was like, all right, I'm probably going to be doing some damage if I continue to play this. So I had to... Um, stop the pc play turn back on the console to see whatever let me just at least finish uh a, a session or whatever um played on console um and it was fine right um i'm very very disappointed in this game uh for many reasons obviously the uh the performance the fact that it's only 30 fps on console when it doesn't really need to be um it, there's there's i don't see what's really causing this game to have any sort of performance limitations this game is running on a last gen engine it's unreal engine 4 the game's visual design and graphical fidelity is not up there it's 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 literally last gen. It's a cross gen like looking um, title, and when I say cross gen, I'm not saying that it's a step above or anything like that. It's literally uh, mediocre at best in terms of its visual makeup. Um, I'm not a fan of the uh, uh, the character models. Uh, it's lazy uh the vampire designs and stuff it's it's very lazy uh the game doesn't you know look good for a current gen console to be on xbox series x and s and, and pc even on pc the game doesn't look good it's just on pc when you ramp up all the settings it's just shit just looks shiny um so it doesn't look that good so you wonder it's like man what's really why this couldn't even be on this could actually run on xbox one i don't see why it couldn't um the 
things that I do like about the game is I like the environment. I like the redfall, the area. I like the the subtle way they tell the story and to bring you into the uh, the the environmental storytelling and the things that's going on to when you kind of hear the vampires lurking and eating and stuff like that um i like the concept of the game the concept of the game i'm fine with i like it. i like the weapons i like uh, the way you have to take down vampires I like the way you you know you do your missions and stuff and like the the day cycle and that things change uh one thing i noticed in the game because of all the times my pc done crashed i was doing a mission where i had to step out the gate go to the first mission tra travel to the helicopters and no matter what you know each time i play it was either sometimes it'll be nighttime sometimes it'd be daytime sometimes i have a group of people sometimes i don't sometimes i have different types of people different types of enemies that are like that are in my path and it's it's never the same every time i play it's never the same never running into the same enemies at the same spot when i played so i can appreciate that they, there's effort there things i don't like about the game is it's just very bearing a barren so those even though i, I praise some of the, the dynamic of the environment the enemy spawns um i think that's uh pretty cool a lot of times though there is very empty very barren um there's not a lot of life in the game and and it, i don't know maybe it's probably set up that way because it's vampires but i feel like for you know you, you're strapped with a gun and a lot of weapons and you're in this big open world you want to run into enemies more times than not you want to run into some sort of npcs i feel like there's not enough npcs going around um the game is not very detailed in the way it looks and that and that is disappointing the game does look and feel dated it's not doing anything new it's not doing anything unique it just honestly i must say it, it feels like a you know a poor effort from you know arcane and i feel like this game has a lot of potential and, and there's fun to be had in the game uh, rest assured like I, I i was enjoying myself playing by myself and, then, and i'm probably going to play uh multiplayer uh with my son and maybe i can figure out this pc thing um but it's, it's a struggle to go back to the game because there's there's these things like i want to play on pc but i can't because my pc is going to crash um i'd like to play on xbox but i'm not happy with the performance i don't think it's optimal enough for the console that i'm playing on um mind you i'm just coming off of games like uh dead island 2 which looks graphically better it's running at a higher frame rate and um just as uh much content um you know what i mean just it's not vampires and zombies um i just think they could have did a better job with this game don't think it needed it it, it had to launch in a state and you kind of wonder why why this game was uh rushed out definitely needed more time in the oven um there's things uh the way that this game looks um i the game doesn't look good in it the, the art style i don't mind the art style it is what it is that's the arcane art style but that's not the reason why the game is graphically bad the game is graphically bad because uh there's no detail the texture detail is mediocre the gun detail uh is is mediocre the character models is mediocre uh there's some technical uh glitches here and there um that just doesn't seem like it should be happening um and it's just really a shame you know i lost uh, a bet uh to black Bond. i expected this game to be an 80 uh five or better i think on metacritic this game is like uh 60. a lot of people are going you know throwing their um two cents on the game a lot of, some of it is legit some of it are, are just people you know riding the wave uh because they feel like obviously it's always a good time to uh kick xbox or you know xbox related content that's what sells um personally you're hearing from me as somebody who was interested in the game wanted to like the game had you know anticipation for the game and still want to play the game um but right now i can't play like i want to for the simple fact that i can't the best way for me to play would be on pc but my pc is keeps it, it's crashing and um I don't uh, playing a first person shooter at 30 frames per second is just it's just not cutting it i don't that's it's not cool so um right now obviously can't recommend uh the game at this point in time and launched in a bad state and in an xbox bethesda all of them really should be ashamed how they let this game come out um this game didn't deserve that um and it needed more time in the oven to cook and hopefully they get some patches out quickly to address some of the concerns especially visually performance wise and on pc uh but 
Let me guys know what you thought. If you're actually playing this game, if you actually going to give this game a realistic chance, a lot of these dudes aren't giving this game a realistic chance and they couldn't wait uh, for this moment. Um, and me personally, I, I'm giving this game a realistic chance, but I just wanted to give you my initial impressions. I like I said, I don't expect to review the game. I expect to you know play it, beat it, whatever. Um, but right right now, it's hard for me. I don't think I I'll get through the game anytime soon until these patches start coming uh, to address some of the concerns uh, that I have with the game. But you no, know, otherwise, that's it for me, man. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. See you guys on the next video. As always, Xbox is the best box. I am the best bot. Good night or good morning if you're on the other side of the globe. I'm out of here. Peace.